E10 is being touted as a greener alternative to the petrol you put in your car. The fuel is made up of 90% normal petrol and 10% bioethanol. That's compared to standard unleaded fuel, which only has 5% bioethanol. Ethanol is an alcohol-based fuel that's made from fermenting corn and sugarcane. As it's a renewable energy source, the government's hoping to use it as part of its strategy to reduce carbon emissions. E10 is already being widely used in the US, Australia and other parts of Europe. But experts are worried that when it comes here, lots of people won't be able to use it. That's because hundreds of thousands of older models, including Volkswagen Golfs, Nissan Micras and many more, are incompatible with the new fuel. Of course, E10 does come with environmental problems of its own. Groups have made links between the demand for bioethanol crops and the destruction of natural habitats like rainforest. The Department for Transport is currently undertaking a consultation on E10 and they say they're hoping to find a solution that's both greener and doesn't put the owners of older cars at a disadvantage. <laughs>